Well, hey guys, once again, we have inventory that has showed up from British Columbia, which is fantastic to see because they're dealing with some, uh, some water issues there. Um, also nice to see that the boxes have no water damage on it. So that's a good plus. Um, this inventory we've been waiting for a couple weeks now. So I've, I think I've pretty much lost track of um lost track of pretty much anything that we have ordered so uh this is just about as much of a surprise for me as it would be for you guys so let me dig into it and we'll discuss what we got another stampede 4x4 uh, kit uh, so if you enjoy kits and you want to stampede this is probably a really cool kit to go with it comes with everything all you need to do is add uh, paint and a battery Traxxas LCG kit we got some on point tools um, on point uh, support Canadian, MIP, and the, uh, the LCG kit. What are these? These are the ball. So this has got a ball end on it, which is really nice. Uh, if you can't get into a spot and you have to approach the, uh, the screw on an angle, uh, these are really nice to have. Not, not a necessity, but very nice. Uh, eight mil driver. This is for me. It's not too often you run into uh, an eight mil nut uh, on an RC car, but uh, it's slowly been happening, especially with Traxxas, the uh, UDR, the uh, Max also has an eight mil nut. So they're starting to see more and more. Uh, paddle tires for snow, two stage foam for your trail trucks. got Bigfoot so we got the Bigfoot body I think we've also got all the stickers and the light bars and the grill and everything that go with it this is a Traxxas Max replacement body just a paintable one uh, we didn't tie my bag but favorite bag of goodies showed up. Maybe I'll go through this in a minute here. Okay, 1.9 trenchers. Um, they work really well. Don't sell many, but they do work really well. Pro-Line shocks. So these are the Pro 2 short course truck shocks. So these are the fronts, so they're a little shorter. And these are the rears, they're a little longer. Um, uh, another little frivolous thing, but really nice to have, are these MIP turnbuckle wrenches. Um, they're not the cheapest turnbuckle wrench, but I'll tell you, they're super nice to have. I do have a set, personally, for myself. Um, I love them, use them all the time. Didn't think I would use them as much as I do, but I do use them. Uh, Element RC Enduro, uh, Senduro, uh, bearing, full bearing kit. More hex drivers, because we were out of stock. So these are the non-ball end hex drivers. Uh, they, I, I, we, again, I use all MIP tools. Uh, I love the quality and uh, believe it or not, my uh, customers and friends all use my tools and I've yet to break one. So uh, you get what you pay for, for sure with tools. Put it 
another set of these. Now these are uh, 2.8 trenchers. These are the all-terrain uh, um, belted version. So I got a set of these. These are for inventory. Facebook is down. I haven't been able to post yet, but we are doing the Pembroke Parade and the Petawawa Parade. The Pembroke Parade is the 11th of December. We're going to be meeting at 5 p.m. behind the... Oh, we're meeting at 4.30 behind the um, Metro. Uh, the That's what it's called, right? The Metro? The, the supermarket. Um... So we'll be back behind there. We're gonna have a big trailer. When you arrive, uh, you're gonna to need to fill your name out just for, um, I guess, the tracing for COVID. It shouldn't be a big deal. More notepads. Chris, if you're seeing this, dude, I have so many. <laughs> uh, if anyone wants a notepad, uh, you can come and get a notepad. Uh, courtesy from HPD my main supplier for Traxxas and uh, Gen Zace, well pretty much all this stuff that you've seen uh, on point, another battery ah. is there a toaster? ooh yeah Patagonia's uh, a lot of scale guys really like these Super cool tread, nice wide square. Good looking tire. I don't want to... What do we got here? Latrax. Pink Teton. Oh yeah. So we thought we'd bring this in for the Christmas season. This is a VXL. Uh, Bandit, if you're not familiar, they're stupid fast. Uh, go check them out. There's a big difference between the brush to brushless. As far as I'm concerned, this may be a little overpowered, but uh, I'm not sure if that's even a thing. Can you be overpowered? No, you can't. You can't be overpowered. So uh, uh, this would be ridiculously fast. Uh, I don't remember the price or I quote it right now. Oh, there it is on there it is on the floor. So. Uh, <laughs> Well, welcome to 110 Hobbies unboxing video. <laughs> um, yeah, so it just launched out of the box there. Um, now you get a closer look at the really cool purple and yellow. Uh, that was great. That was uh, very interesting. Okay. Well, we'll make sure we put this back. <laughs> Set of tires for a customer, another set of paddles. Two sets of Patagonias. They're Pat Patagonia, right? Yeah, Patagonia. Another set of foams. Just ripping through. The 11.1 .1 volt, uh, 500,000 or 5,000 mAh. Uh, these are a fantastic battery. Uh, super underrated. Uh, they're great. Believe me, they're good. Traxxas batteries. A VXL combo. A wheelie bar, so this is the team. So it's better late than ever, though, right? I mean, I guess drag season's over. Uh, so this is for the uh, DR10. This is a aluminum and carbon fiber wheelie bar. Um, they're certainly not cheap. Uh, they've definitely proven themselves. Uh, they're strong. Uh, so if you're looking for a really, really high-end 
wheelie bar for your drag car, it's here and it's taken a very long time to get it. I know somebody that'll be excited to get this. Jay, if you're watching, lift kit is in stock. Oh, maybe I shouldn't say that. I hope his wife's not watching. <laughs> Busted. Uh, <laughs> Uh, double battery charger. I love these Bluetooth. Uh, you can program your batteries. They're really good. And last but not least, the Fox Racing. Uh, this is for a customer. We do actually have one in stock, but uh, you know, that's for a customer. All right. So I think that's I think that's it. Let me grab this thing again here. We'll wander around the store. Um, what else is good? Maybe show off a bit of stock that we've got. Uh, the DR10 drag cars. Sorry, the DR28s. Keep showing this guy off. Oh, we've opened it. I can't remember if we showed you. Yep. It's awesome. Not not my cup of tea. I'm definitely not a nitro guy. But for the nitro guys out there, um, definitely a sweet ride. And then, so this is a 110 Hobbies custom built truck. Uh, this is completely been stripped down, rebuilt. Um, it's got tons of aftermarket stuff on it. Uh, it's not cheap, but it's complete and it's ARTR. All you need to do is add your radio. Well guys and girls, if there's any girls watching, I doubt it, it's pretty nerdy. So. <laughs> All right, signing out. Thanks for joining us, guys. Uh, we will thank you, the tank. Oh, yeah, uh, just a shout out to Tank. Uh, if you guys have not seen his YouTube videos, please go have a look. He's a local guy. He does a lot of live streams at night. Uh, 110 Hobbies on occasion does support him when he needs some stuff. So he's done some 110 Hobbies reviews. Uh, the tank is, yeah, he is indeed watching from Ottawa. He's, uh, he's been a huge asset to us, so please go share, like, subscribe, comment, do whatever you got to do to the Tank RC. And don't forget, uh, 110 Hobbies also needs some love. Uh, we are looking to grow. We've got some pretty rad ideas coming. Not yet, buddy. Not yet. Uh, I'm sorry about that, dude. The uh, Camino bodies are just uh, not the easiest to get. Uh, they're very much in demand. All right, signing out. Thanks, guys, for joining.